Welcome. My name is Sharoni Sibony, and I'll be the instructor facilitator for this Legacy Project course. By using stories and narratives as our main resource, we aim to fuel alternative ways of seeing across a broad range of physical and cultural contexts. We'll be bringing in different guest artists doing different modules. These folks will all be working artists in different disciplines and will have a chance to hear a little bit about their own stories as we learn some of their techniques. The stronger that you are in yourself and the confidence that you have within yourself, you could show up for the people that are in your organization and that are, that are needing for you. Boom, 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 boom. Human beings have a need for connection. Common ground is very, very important. And the game is called Fortunately, Unfortunately. Unfortunately, that means my only option is to go to the moon. <laughs> nice. <laughs> it's like a lot of circles, a lot of spirals. And to me, that teaching is, is connecting within again. And knowing that things in our life come in circles and cycles, right? Being authentic at such a young age and so wise. So I'm hopeful for the future, especially for Mississauga Center. The shared questions of our course together are, how can we use stories and art to convey our experiences of border crossings, both literal and metaphorical? And how can we invite more people into this process through our own projects after the course is over? I don't belong here. I don't belong there. I take root in this third space where borders converge, diverge, intersect. If this third space is a real place, Maybe I'll call it my home. But I would say if I had to pick one, my favorite would always be Korea Park. That's the Brampton Flying Club, which I went to as an air cadet. Creating the enabling garden. <laughs> so I draw that and I put uh, where you are, uh, where are you from? I have these big buttons made up. <laughs> Using the wisdom of our hearts and hands, and our heads, we'll get to build our own collaborative practice of art making with our classmates. As you'll see, this practice will honor both the process and the product or the result. Our hands might even surprise us as we make things we didn't expect. Oh my goodness, I am just blown away, everybody. Thank you so much. 